This video is for criticism and criticism only. I have nothing against the creators of these OCs, and I'm only giving my opinions on them, so please do not get all mad and say that I'm bullying when I'm not. I'm just trying to give some criticism is all. Well, anyways, if you have not read the title, this is a video, this is a rant on Mary Sue's. I'm not just going to talk about these three in particular. Well, mainly about these three. But anyways, for those of you who don't know what a, what a Mary Sue is, it's basically a character with no flaws or no personality and everybody falls in love with them. And how to point out a Mary Sue is they have big, gigantic boobs and overly fat asses. <laughs> and they constantly put themselves in multiple fandoms. And they have a bunch of sex RPs with many guys. I'm looking at all of you right here. And they're paired with multiple people. And they all make women look like sex toys. And they sick their fan brats on them. On, no, not them. On people who are just trying to state their opinions on their characters. Because they can't accept criticism at all. And basically they make themselves look like bimbos. <laughs> I'm sorry. And also pointing out recolors is also um, a trait of a Mary Sue, such as Akai and freaking Princess Elizabeth. Honestly, the only thing Akai is a recolor is because she looks just like Amy. She looks like Amy, but an older version. And yeah, this pretty much speaks for itself right here. Shadow recolor. <gasps> what? <laughs> oh, that's right. She doesn't recolor. Oh yeah. Nope. Definitely not. Anyways, for those, they pretty much like I said that they make their characters look like sex toys. Is because here's Akai. She drew rape a pregnant freaking threesome. With Shadow and Sonic in a whole bunch of porn of her character and Sonic and Shadow having freaking sex. Like, are you freaking kidding me? Why? Just why? And Princess Elizabeth, she requested somebody to draw her porn. Well, quote unquote, Shadow on top of Princess Elizabeth biting her neck or something like that. And Elizabeth is blushing and moaning. Oh, I wonder what that could be. Hmm. Maybe like Jinx said, it's probably an adult version of Twister. Yeah, this cotton cattail toonie pretty much speaks for herself right here. But yeah, her entire gallery is her character showing off her boobs and her butt. But, well... I'm saying I'm not saying her art is bad. I'm just like, why would you portray your character this way? Like, why would you use your talent to portray? Hi, you you have great art. You really do. Now, Princess Elizabeth. I mean, your art's not the worst, but I mean, you are pretty good with the MM that MMD stuff. But honestly, I th your character just, it's a recolor, and you recolored over Sonic X pictures. I mean, if you really want to improve, try drawing yourself. Try, draw, yeah, try improving your design. That goes for all of these characters. Improve your design so they don't look like they're toys. And don't, have, and don't make everyone you... Fall in love with you instantly, because that does not work in the real world. And I get that OCs are not like this is a fantasy world, but still, I mean, how many people, how many cartoon characters do you go see portraying their boobs and butts? I mean, they do that in most animes, but not all. Like a good anime would be Full Metal Alchemist. They don't show off their boobs and their butts, but, uh, that's just an example, they don't show off, they don't go praying, 
They don't go parading around saying, oh, look at my big boobs and look at how big my ass is. No, they don't do that. But what I'm saying is, you guys have your guys' art is good. You just gotta, you just gotta redesign. Like really try a real redesign. I mean, just tone it down on the big bus. Then recolors. I mean, just tone it down a bit. I mean, cotton cat cat ah cotton cat looks toony. Your character would look so much better if her boobs weren't so big. I actually sketched her character, and this is how big her boobs actually are. I did not exaggerate anything. I just I sketched it the way it was, in and basically, I just I sketched all of these. I didn't like I didn't exaggerate on any of these factors. I pretty much sketched them, and they look like this. The same goes for Kai. You're, like, I mean, the character's boob size is not as bad, but don't go showing it off. You, the same goes for all of you three. All of you. Just don't go showing your character's boobs and butts off, and don't make people fall in love with her instantly, and at least try to and, and accept criticism, and don't ex don't stick fan brats on people because you can't accept it. The same goes for any fan base actually who make female characters and <clears throat> like I said in Full Metal Alchemist some people think Winry is a Mary Sue like, Winry is not is nowhere near a Mary Sue she doesn't go saying oh come and get in my bed and all that stuff she doesn't look like any of this and she basically Winry's a good character in my opinion I, I like Winry, and I don't see her as a Mary Sue at all. I mean, she doesn't act like one. She has, she's pretty badass. But anyways, this is all, all you guys need to do is just improve a little, and just, that's all you need to do, just improve your characters. I'm, I'm not saying that your characters are bad, just, you just need to improve them, okay? Alright. Thank you all for watching this, and I hope you have a good night. And um, this is this is me signing off. Peace.